Hey everyone, welcome to my channel ASP.NET Core and today I am going to show you how to fix that type of error. Actually uh, here we have a view components and uh, inside the view components here we have a cart view components.cs file and that class uh, that is inherited from the view components file and I got that type of error actually uh, occurs. A view component named cart view could not be found. A view component must be a public non-abstract class not contain any generic parameter and either be decorated with a view component attribute or have a class named ending with the view component okay so uh, ending with the view component you uh, notice that uh, a class uh, with the view component is a must you you know that so here we have a view component so if you uh, got that type of error because uh, hi i have a uh, class that is cart view component and I initialize in the uh, components here we have a cart view it's not a cart view actually it's a cart only so just rename it uh, and so just rename it and that name is match with your folder name cart okay so uh, here we have a folder in the uh, my root file uh, view component and inside we have a cart view component file and that class is end with the view component file okay so the file name is actually a cart okay and the default.cshtml file inside in the shared folder and in the components folder and the cart folder also we have so inside the shared folder components and inside the components the match the name uh, of the component file that is cart and the cart so here we have a default.cshtml file so uh, just after that you can run your project again and your problem will be resolved easily because the match the name is must uh, inside in the case of the uh, view component okay so here we have because the uh, view component uh, have the last ending name is the view component so the file name is cart so the folder name is cart and inside the folder we have a default.cshtml file okay so inside uh, the calling function is also we have a cart function so just layout.cshtml file and here we have a cart only so now they save this if it is here hot reload feature is enabled then you will notice that your problem will be resolved but not ending oops your problem will be resolved easily okay run it again So the name is matched uh, in, in the cart view component. Okay, so here we have. Thank you very much for watching this video.